everyone. Just want to do a post knock on the Salix pod that I got from Talent Cricket. So this one was on special. Normal retail is £195. So when it arrived, uh, as it said on the shoulder, it was two ten and a half. You see that there? And so what I've actually done is it had a full length scuff that went right up to these lines here. And I've removed that, taken off the stickers beforehand, placed back the stickers, and then put a new UK scuff just halfway with edge tape down the bottom. But I've left the polycarbonate toe protector that Salix provide, because um, that's a really decent feature for the toe. So let's see what it weighs now after that. So it's 295, so we've taken an ounce off of it. The other thing you've got to take into account is that down here in Australia, particularly Adelaide, it's quite hot at the moment, so we've got some moisture being lost as it arrives down here and acclimatizes. It's natural for willow that has been, or any wood that's been dried, to basically adjust its moisture level to the environment. So I'm really quite happy with this, 295. A mid-middle, I think we said 33mm edges, a traditional round face. It does have a fairly decent bow in it, uh, and I really like the profile, just sort of all that wood in the hitting area, and then sort of coming down to a fairly decent sized toe. Now remember this is a five grain, and a lot of you would go, ugh, there's five grains. But it's actually really pinging quite well. It's a very well pressed button. And yeah, I think it actually pings quite well. So for £195, and I've seen some beauties that Solix put out with 10 or more grains in this grade too, but you're basically looking at potentially things like knots or something, some sort of blemish that won't affect performance, but uh, the bat maker naturally has to downgrade it. But yeah, the Salix finish, as I've said before, is just beautiful. Really well made bats. It picks up now, I think it picks up under 2.9. And the other thing is, this grip that they put on, the Lotex grip, they do get uh, dirty quite easy, but it only weighs one ounce, even though it's a hybrid grip. So these are like half an ounce less than a normal grip you would get in the shops. Wear quite fast but they've got a nice soft feel about them and they're very light. So let's turn the camera around and we'll do our final bounce on it. Right. Okay, so first thing is the four piece. So that round face can easily get away. It's pinging everywhere. Uh, it probably needs a little bit of play in but it will get better and better. It's the Duke. Hitting mostly down at the toe, aren't I? Let's try and hit it in the middle. So yeah, very happy with the uh, Salix pod. Um, obviously you can get these in much higher grades, finishing at the finite grade. But yeah, really well made bat, and uh, well done to Andrew Kemba and his team down there at Salix. So, thanks everybody, bye.